kept coming to this for you. Virgo. Thank you for being here. Expression, emotions, like holding back some things, protecting some things through stubbornness. But not really saying everything that needs to be said. Directing your focus their intentions on pentacles there's love here also for you we're gonna get into your reading now hey virgo we're going to get into your reading welcome to my channel and i hope that you're well virgo is the sixth sign of the zodiac Virgo is an earth sign. Their symbol is the goddess of fertility. Their element is earth. Their ruling planet is Mercury. Virgos are goal oriented, hard working, earth signs, focused, determined, uh, focused on pentacles too, and love matters. So let's get into it. Pentacles, defending your pentacles, holding on, gathering your pentacles. So you, I feel like you're sitting, you're gathering your pentacles. You are looking where to invest in order for it to grow more. So you're really focusing on your pentacles today. Your money could be money or your sense of self-worth, your values, your integrity, virtues, whatever you hold dear to you. You're holding on to them really tightly not relaxed but very protective as if you have been tried before and you're really protecting your pentacles yes as if you know loss to lose yourself your emotions to let your emotions your thoughts get the better of you or to have spent money in areas that were, were not beneficial to you. You're looking to really elevate, raise up your sense of self-worth in the society, Virgos. The world, in the society, in the world. Things are coming into you, transformations. So look out for transformations in your finances. Uh, there's space for you to change. There will be opportunities coming into you to Take the actions that are in alignment with your desires. So just look out for these opportunities. There could be someone across the world that is um, seeing you, appreciating your work, might want to work with you. Someone coming into your world or you moving into another kind of world. As I said, I feel like you want to raise your standards, your pentacles as well. So I feel like you're trying to change the vibration of your world. The Nine of Wands. You are manifesting. Your desires are coming through. You're seeing that. But I feel like you have to be careful of what you're doing. Who you're letting in. Into your world. Who you're sharing your ideas with. People might be after your produce, you know, there are people like that in this world that goes after your, after you have come up with an idea, someone might want to steal it from you. So I feel like you're very protective at this time of your energy, of your money, of your labor. Watch out, watch your back. Be careful who you're welcoming into your space. The Queen of Wands, an attractive woman. So you could be welcoming a fire sign in your energy space. Attractive, beautiful, intuitive, passionate, very desirous person. Their energy is glowing. They're very strong to you. They appear to be strong and self-sufficient and ready. They're, they are 
I feel like you're not really talking to this person. You are trying to ignore them, but they're very attractive. Their energy spreads over into your energy. So it's like you're trying to ignore this person. Could be a lover, a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I feel like this person comes and maybe takes from you, hold their hand out and you give to them. But no, I feel like you want to be wiser. The wands again, Virgo. Like you're facing your facing some battles here but the thing is you the beauty about it is that you have the upper hand to deal with this situation as they come so this is your world you are able to conquer whatever attacks you root out what no longer serves you this could be your own ideas and feelings strengthening yourself empowering yourself being courageous being strong Knowing when to say no, knowing what's good for you, being a real champion of your own life here. You could be nourished by water, really expressing yourself as if... It's, I feel like maybe you, you are in a place where you're working and coming up with ideas. You're not very emotional at this time. Strength. Oh, strength card. Adopt. I feel like you need to adopt to your environment, your world, your transformation. You have to adopt. Adaptability. Know that you're strong, you're capable of even multitasking getting stuff done doing like being a financial advisor and a farmer two different types of jobs that you're passionate about you probably are good at and you're doing it because of your pentacles you want to empower yourself empower your life So you're being careful this time around. You're taking action, you're being very brave. So you're, you're not giving up even though you may have been mistreated or abused, taken advantage of and left out in the dumps. You know, I feel like a change is coming into your world where you're able to recognize your strength, your sense of self-worth, and belonging you have a lot to share to speak so I feel like you do share but not very intimately so you could be one that gives words of encouragement but you don't really share how you feel intimately you're very dis defensive of your emotions because they have been come, like, ruined before by a person that came and baited your love. Just took from your energy, your willingness, your kindness. And so you decided, I'm not going to be that person anymore. This could all just be coming up now in your week. I feel like you're going to be dealing with some thoughts, feelings, some, some sort of opposition, but you will come out victorious because you're strong and you'll continue to be successful in your work. You'll, be, you'll continue to prosper. Prosperity, success, manifestation. There's a lot of ones, fiery, passionate um, energy in your reading creativity, abundance, flourishing, fertility, virility. You may be very in a high sense of, in a high state, in a high energy you now of uh, bursting as if you have energy stored up 
in you. That's how you feel. You may be on a quest to, to align with something, to, to, <laughs> to find someone to help to ease this, this energy. It could be a water sign that you're looking for. But there's, a, there's some blockages here when it comes to you finding this, this person. And the blockages are mainly inside of yourself because of your past experiences. So you're, you're, you're dealing with some emotions here, intense emotions. It could be anger, it could just be frustration. The Emperor. Stability. So you're coming to a place of stability. I feel like you're settling in to the new life. To you're you're coming to an a, a place of acceptance of who you are, where you are. You could be a CEO and probably reading for an older person or a person that is very mature in thinking, in acting maturely to get what they want out of this life. Purposeful person. going inside of yourself setting boundaries developing your sense of worth setting up your boundaries that's good working on your pentacles we there may be a test of charm coming in passion There, like there's something coming in that will awaken this is this is maybe this energy is moving out of your life this easily triggered energy could be your anger it's dissipating that's what I'm saying I feel like you're coming to a place of stability settling mastery of energies because you know how strong you are you have come to find your strength your sense of self it's coming into your world you're not looking for validation so these meaningless feelings are moving out of you and you're coming back more empowered the ten of pentacles financial abundance stability magnificence attracting wealth wealth situation good people situations around you ten of pentacles is a beautiful card of new beginnings of Maybe new financial beginnings as well. I feel like that's what you're working toward. Being in a more elevated sense of self when it comes to your pentacles. I feel like you're looking at looking out for self-respect and respect for your for from your peers, from others around you, for them to dignify you or see you as dignified, as accomplished. Mm -hmm. or that is what will be happening I feel like you need to know how to use these energies these I feel like it's upset anger frustration that comes into you from time to time could be this person there is a feeling they're going and they're taking the energy that they brought with them I feel like you're being there's a purge happening and then this energy is leaving you like you could have been involved in a highly passionate relationship that caused you to be tripping not 
think clearly, make faulty decisions, especially regarding your pentacles. It could be some addiction, eating addiction, spending, wanting to impress others, wanting to relieve yourself, maybe um, with your, your libido. That's the kind of passion that the fire signs are bringing here in your reading. Like there's an end to that sense of lack of control in this energy. It could be anger as well. So you find balance, you're finding stability here, men coming through again. There's stability coming in for you in this week. There's an end to a cycle that has been repeating itself in your world. And you're deciding to dive into yourself, find balance and stability, know who you are, to, to find value in yourself and in others, to remain grounded, focused on your visions. Carrying your own weight, taking responsibility, putting in the work. <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh. A lot of pentacles in your reading. You're working hard on your money, putting in the work, the Eight of Pentacles. You are getting offers for, for what you are creating. I feel like you're, you are a creator, you work with your hands and there's a big offer coming into you for the job that you are doing. You're working hard, pulling your own weight and I feel like your finances are, are looking up. The Queen of Pentacles at the top of your game. I feel like you're looking in a different direction. It's no longer about passion and sex or just having loose emotions that take you nowhere. It's more about purposefulness, aligning with purpose. Like aligning with an energy that keeps you focused on garnering your self-worth and your money. The wheel of fortune things are turning in your favor maybe you want to get married to someone who makes you feel stable and balanced an earth sign like yourself taurus virgo capricorn and we have fire sign as well in your chart aries leo sagittarius uh, Okay, Virgo, thank you so much for being here. Let's get final messages for you. new beginnings, new projects, you're being more focused, more purposeful, more grounded, have boundaries, working on your sense of self, four of pentacles here again, four of wands, yes man, getting to understand your intuition, being speaking how you feel, not really letting a lot of people into your life right now. I feel like you feel like a loner too. Not letting a lot of people in. Cutting out certain and I feel like that's good because certain things that come around you just to take from you without giving is 
being cut out of your life. You're standing firmer, more confident, more sure in yourself. And that's good to hear, Virgo. Thank you so much for being here. That is your reading. And I'll catch you next time. Much love. Bye.